welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the hot, 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 hottest post show in all of wrestling podcast history. That's right. It is time for talking mayhem mania. I am your apparently host, Mad Mike, since uh, Mac Rollins has been doing his other duties, and and Chad is taking over as the uh, the officiant, as you will, over Ma- over mayhem mania. So I have become the de facto Caleb Braxton of this bitch. And I will do my best not to fuck it up. And now we go to Matt. Hi, Matt. Hello. Hello, my friend. Yes, I apologize. Um, I, I won't belabor this point any much longer because I went on and on about it on Monday. Of course, my internet connection was barely working on Monday. So perhaps nobody heard what happened. But anyway, I have, I have other work-related duties going on on Tuesday nights now, which makes me unable to properly dedicate my time to the process of of the live Mayhem Mania matchmaking process. So basically what's happening now is I am sort of locked away in a soundproof booth while you folks are making your matches. I'm doing my work. I'm doing my business. And now I am here. I know nothing about what has happened over the past two or three hours. I don't know how long you guys took to do this tonight. (laughs) Um, And we're going to find out what matches you folks made. And I will cast judgment upon them because I've been doing this for a long time. Um, so, yeah, uh, thanks for having me, Mad Mike. <laughs> My pleasure. And Chad, it is wonderful to see you. I thank you very much. You've done a great service for your country. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Just happy to be here. Here. So, should I just go ahead and start off with, uh, how we ran tonight? Can we, t- uh, can we not tell him who picked the matches just tell him the match oh then, oh yeah let's uh, let's yeah. have matt guess who made the match that, that, yeah, that's yeah, a fun then, game i just then, well, just want to make sure i'm clear is everyone who made a match in my field of view right now uh, except uh sorg did not make a match yes okay <clears throat> yes yeah. so uh excellent. the what we had this evening were six individuals and we had to make one match for night one and another match for night two so they each each person made two matches this evening but before we did anything, I told these gentlemen here this evening to give me two wrestlers, and that's it. Just give me two two wrestlers. Uh, they went through, gave me their wrestlers, and then I quickly put them in space jail. <laughs> did you so tell the re- them you were going to put them in space jail? No, I did not the tell them. Wrestlers? I said they had a special assignment. We would do something fun with them. Uh, those individuals are as followed. <laughs> uh, Cassie Lee, mm. Jesse McKay. That's too bad. Sonny Kiss. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oscar. Oh. Miro. Oh. Darby Allen. Oh. The Lucha Brothers, which was oh. one pick because I let them go in as a tag team, but they had to use both their picks. Oh. Uh, Commander Sterling. Commander. Okay. Ziggy Heim. Mm. Avery Good, mm. and Ultra Mantis Black. <laughs> Can't have him running around. So, so Space Jail already has some residents. Good. Good. Hey, You've done Matt, fine Matt, work. Matt. You know, the Iconics spent like all of last year's Mayhem Mania hey, in hey, Space Matt, Jail, too. Matt, you want to guess, guess who put them in Space Jail? Uh, who put the Iconics in Space Jail? Uh huh. Yeah, because it wasn't me. <laughs> Chad gave it away. I saw him pointing at himself. That's Boom. Boom. No, no, no. no. It wasn't Chad? No, it wasn't Chad at all. Oh. No, I mean no. you physically put them in there. Yes. Well, 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 you, well, well there's my guess. So if that's <laughs> up. Who get, who put them in there? Boom. Oh, Riz put them in there. Yeah. Oh. Riz, the Riz chose the Riz chose first. Island. The first participants in Space Jail. Nice. Riz Excellent. chose violence well, already. That's a great. That's a great job. Now, um, Chad, do you think we should? Uh, are we going to do any wheel spinning? Wheel spinning fun to try to get people out of space, Joe? What are you thinking on this? What do you, you want to do? Uh, one right now? Well, we, I don't think we have to do one right now. I mean, the longer we got to let them settle in first before they. Uh, yeah. You know, we want well, them to appreciate their freedom. Right next well, season, I mean, you know, to I be don't fair, think they have. Uh, I don't think they have their. They're still in uh, booking and processing. I don't they, think they have their cell numbers assigned to them. Yet. <laughs> yeah, they right. are all celebrities. I mean, you know, know so celebrities don't have jail. a lot of help. <laughs> <laughs> celebrities don't have a lot of help. Yeah, no, no, that's true. Well, I, I, yeah, I, you know, we'll uh, we'll we'll try to assign them some some cell numbers. Then we'll, you know, 
maybe a spin of the wheel next week. We'll see if somebody can get out. That might be, um, yeah, that might, we might lead off with that or maybe a surprise spin right in the middle of something that really jams some people up. Like right now. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> no they're still in booking and processing, Riz. We have rules and regulations when you first get into space. Jim. Now, once you get in, hey, whatever. But, space jail is not a lawless place. Yeah. Space jail has rules. All right. Let's, uh, look, I, I, hey, I'm curious about can, these matches. We can make it a lawless place by putting in the gavel, David Lawless. <laughs> Very true. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So would you like to hear the, the matches that were made for night one? WWE. I would love to start hearing some matches, and I would love to see if I could figure out which one of you crazy folks came up with these matches. Okay, I believe my notes are correct. If I do uh, mispronounce something or get something wrong, please let me know, because I wrote these down kind of quick, and sometimes my handwriting gets a little away from me. Uh, We have a fatal four-way here, Beth Phoenix versus Mm -hmm. uh, Bianca Belair versus Rio versus uh, Raquel Gonzalez. Oh, Rio Ripley. No. No. Yeah. No, Rhea. Rhea Ripley. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. It's all WWE. Ripley. Sorry. Yeah. That's pretty good. That sounds like um that sounds like a DP match to me, honestly. That sounds like that might be DP. Was that DP? That was indeed, yes. Ow. Right there. You are one for one. Ooh. Let's go. How about about this? No hesitation. How about this? If Matt goes six for six for each night, we'll spin the wheel. We'll spin the wheel. <laughs> Sounds good. Even though so your next like, match. Even though they're not in, in their cell Even though they're not going to have a cell number. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, you know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, Roderick Strong versus Randy Orton. Ooh, that is nice. That That's that's a worker's kind of match. Um, wonder if that might be uh, that might be Justin Idol's match. Is that Justin Ooh, Idol's match? Right, two for is. two. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, all right. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. He, he said that might be a worker's match. I was like, oh, yeah, I was like, because oh, no. if he I know I'm a worker in this room right now, he knew, he knew it wasn't Ronnie. <laughs> yeah, oh, this one. Oh, uh, yeah, you get down oh, now. You got you process elimination, so you're two for two. You're retired. Yeah. Poor don't yeah, don't dog on Ronnie. You know what? Next Ronnie week, knows I'm just fun in this. <laughs> your next, your third match here we have is uh, Brock Lesnar versus Cesaro. Brock Lesnar versus Cesaro. Wow. Um, I think we've been down this road before. I'm trying to remember who made this match before. <laughs> we, have some, we have some stubborn individuals here. Mm, oh, man. Um, you know what? That might be a Ronnie Starks match. Let's just try it for Ronnie Starks. Mm, uh, no. Nope. Sorry. Dang it. That's, All right. that's a good guess, but you're wrong. That's a very good guess. All right. Who was it? It was me. Oh, good job, Riz. Riz. Well done. All right. Next. You covered uh... your tracks well. <laughs> Walter versus Samoa Joe. Oh, you let this one through? Yep. Samoa Joe? Yes. You had to relinquish the NXT championship due to various undisclosed injuries? Yes. You sure it's safe? About this. Yes. What's the match again? Joe Walter versus, versus Joe. Oh, dead. Um, <laughs> Walter? Um, that might be Mad Mike. That yeah, Mike? Not... No. Well, you like it was me. Ah! Mainstream Matt. It See, was and, me. It, it, and, and it's funny because I even asked, I had to preface it by saying, is Samoa Joe still <laughs> employed by WWE? It was most, me, awesome. One of the most asked questions of Mayhem Mania over the last few years has been, is Samoa Joe okay to use? Is he clear? <laughs> yes. Once, I, once, I we got, once we got Brian back, Samoa Joe was the new, is he cleared? You know. And uh, now for the fifth match here, we have a tag match. Uh, Sammy and Kevin Ooh. versus the Usos. The Usos? Mm-hmm. Is that Ron Starks? You are correct, sir. All right. Nice one. Nice one. I dig it. We got to get Kevin and Sammy back together. They won it so right. bad. So then our last match here, which I'm sure you can probably – Pick whose this is. Uh, I don't know. The four horsewomen, Charlotte, Sasha, Bailey, and Becky. I cleared mm-hmm. Bailey. I, I cleared She's fine. Her. She's good. She's yeah, be no ready. Yeah. Versus yeah, the Hurt definitely. Business. 
Wait, wait. Who's in the hurt business? Oh, MVP's the fourth. Okay. I think Mad Mike cooked that one up. Is that true? Is that Mad yeah. Mike's Mad? Yeah, that's me. What a maniac. All right. Uh-huh. Four and that's two. that's the uh, that's the card for WWE night. Not too bad, not too bad. I gave it a B minus. Still some work to do, but a solid foundation to build off of. Yeah, you gotta like gotta get a little bit wild, but uh, you know we always kind of like you know you gotta kind of check these boxes early in the weeks. You know yeah. you're kind of like we gotta get this name in here. Tina uh, called so just it. Want some of these names to get used. Tina, yeah, called, you gotta Tina bounce called... some stuff off of people. Then other people get ideas for seeing matches, and they're like, oh yeah, they that wouldn't be too. Yeah, yeah. And, and you gotta, I, you gotta I, find I think, out who's holding a grudge against who. You know, who's yeah. gonna come in next week and start messing stuff up. And I, I think you were right, Matt. I think it was actually me that made that match earlier on, like earlier in the years, with Lesnar and. Mm-hmm. That, sounds, that sounds accurate. It sounds very familiar. Um, and I'll say th- this year, where uh, in past years a lot of the matches were, oh, we want to use this person who's never used by WWE in Mayhem Mania. They're no longer part of WWE anymore. <laughs> yeah. So it's kind of like, oh, and oh, yeah, they're not. Yeah. No. Ironically, I, <laughs> no one used castoffs. Which <laughs> brings us to what? night two. Yeah. So the non WWE night. Oh, keep going. Yeah, oh, oh. Mayhem Mania. <laughs> so we have All six right. matches here. Uh, let's see. Match number one Britt Baker and Adam Cole versus CM Punk and AJ Lee. <laughs> Mad Mike, was that you? That it was. Uh, <laughs> was. Was. You're delicious. Um, Got to have that inner gender. No, Got to do it. Got to do it once. It has to happen. Uh, because I forget what we said his his name is now, but it's it's Braun Strowman versus uh, Jonathan Gresham. Oh, really? Oh, that's great. Um, oh man, who came up with that? You guys are all so clever. Um, Alex, is that you? Is that yours? Yep, that's the one. Oh, wow. Yes. Wow. You start strong. Two for two again. <laughs> oh man, I, I, you know, I didn't think I'd be any good at this. I might. Mean, all right, third match. I gained here. some knowledge over the years here. Okay. The Fiend versus the Great Muta. <laughs> Um. Oh my God. Oh, I don't. Justin. Justin. Yeah, wow. Bad yeah. Bermuda. All right. Oh, wow. <laughs> he's fit. He's. We may get somebody. Uh, we may take a spin of that wheel. But the we're nice halfway thing. Halfway there. The nice Whoa. thing about this oh. forbidden door thing is we're getting names that have never been mentioned before. Yeah. <laughs> the great Muda has never come up before it in does. like whatever seven or eight years we've been doing. This. That's really. Oh God. So funny. <laughs> That's our fault. He could have. Yeah, he You're was right. there. He's right I mean, there. like that one time we just opened the opened the doors before. We hit yeah, Andre the Giant's yeah. ghost. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Andre the Giant's ghost. You left Muda on book. <laughs> if you back up the truck, you back up the Brinks truck, he'll come. So just come on. Start paying the man. He'll come out spitting. Yeah, exactly. Literally. Oh, yeah. All right. So we'll take a look at match number four here. Dalton Castle versus War Horse. <laughs> Riz? Riz, is that you? That is me. Damn. Oh, four, four for four. Four, four, four for four. This Amazing. is it. The last one. Man. Okay, Ronnie here. A, I'm going to uh, blow this. I'm sorry. A, uh, let's see. Great match, Riz. Thank you. Love it. Let's do O'Reilly and Fish, Red Dragon versus the Wolves of, uh, what is that, Edwards and Richards? Punchy and Kicky. Um. <laughs> Which one are you two? The Wolves versus Red Dragon? Yeah. In a zoo Ron- match. No. <laughs> Ronnie. Ronnie. Is it you? It is me. Oh, yes! Wow. We get- <laughs> wow. Bravo. Bravo, Matt Carlin. Oh, man. Bravo. Wow. So, hey, it's great yeah, to have the process baby. of elimination. You know who this this last match is uh done by. What I need uh it was a team, team bussy, right? Right. Right. Versus Willow. Um, Nighty, Willow Nightingale, Nightingale. Yeah, Nightingale. Willow Nightingale, and I can't read what I wrote here. Uh, Either uh, surreal, surreal. Yes, nice, nice. All right, excellent, excellent. So, so let's Fish spin that wheel for him. Wow, 
We don't know which I'm, cell I'm anybody's damn impressed. in. I'm di- how, how about read me back the list of names that people have earned in Space Jail. I'll well, choose one to release. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, so, so the, the wait, 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 wait. How, wait how, how, how many do we oh, have? Hard. How many do we have? How many are in there? We should have 12. 12. We should have 12. You have 12. The Lucha Brothers All right. I took it for are two we doing a ra- Well, there are 24 slots on here. So depending on where they're at, you have them already in, in, in a list, correct? Yes. So the list is the number. And okay. to make sure, do we want to make sure somebody gets out? Do we guarantee someone gets out? You want to guarantee? Mm. So, yeah. so, so, so you have one through twelve, and then you have thirteen through twenty-four, and that that corresponds, right? Okay. So, okay. Yep. So, so I think that's right. you do like yep. even yep. number, somebody gets out, and if it's an odd number, they no, say no, 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 no. I'm saying, no. I'm saying, person one, person two, and then you go to thirteen. Person one is thirteen. Person two is fourteen, and on through. So everybody, one, 13, two and 14, three everybody, and like it. everybody no. has two chances to get out because it's even because we have 24 slots on the on the, on the wheel. Okay. Are we okay. releasing the Lucha Brothers independently? Then? Independently, uh, yes. correct. Individuals, correct. Okay. individuals. Yeah. All right, you guys ready? <laughs> Big money. Man, this this is exciting. You ready? <gasps> this is exciting. Hold on, I got wheel work. of space jail. Got... Turn, I, turn, I, I, turn. I, I'm gonna laugh, <laughs> Sork. If it's Ziggy Heim. Right. We need to get her to cut a promo about being the first out of space show. Yes. All right. Ready? Yes. She should, she should she make... Here we go. Okay, good. Wow, that was a good Ooh. spin. Look at that. Ooh, good spin. Wow. Powerful spin. Oh, oh, really good no spin. whammies, no whammies, Stick, no whammies. I'm getting dizzy. Uh, All right. 18. 18, which means whoever is the ninth person on the list. 18. Well, since... Hold the, on. 18 would be six. I can't count. Yeah. Yes. Right? <laughs> no, what's 18 divided by 2? The, 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 no, but, no, 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 you're right. right. No, because you got to no. go 12 and it starts over. Yeah. yeah. 13. So, yeah. Yeah, 6. Yeah, yeah so six, it'd be 6. The 6th person confused. on the list. 6th person on the list. I'm so confused. That's Starby Owl. math is messing oh. 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 Let's jump off bump, a, bump. Let's jump off a tall thing. All right. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Oh, well, there you I, go. I tried. That's how it goes sometimes. Yeah. You did. Let's do it again. <laughs> 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 I'm putting it right back in Space Joe next week. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> all right. Um, well, overall, great matches. I must commend all of you. Uh, I'm sorry that I got, I guess, all of those things correctly. I was a little surprised that I <laughs> that did was that. Amazing. I, that I was amazing. I guess after so many years, I've yeah. gotten to know some of you mm-hmm. a little bit too well. So... <laughs> Next week, maybe we'll have some surprises. May it be nice for a change. We'll see what happens. I, I feel like we should play the guess. The guess who made the move every week. <laughs> I, I'd like to see if we can keep keep this uh, train rolling. I like to see how also, long I can keep this going. Also, remember, uh, Beast Man is our guest next week. Ah, Chad, did you establish a no booking yourself rule? <laughs> for any of our many guests. Quite the no, opposite. I did we the talked complete about opposite. <laughs> I'm sure Justin had to be held back. I uh, said I, I, was... <laughs> <laughs> I, I asked this after all the moves were done. Yeah, and I, Justin, I said, Justin was uh, yeah. audibly upset. Yeah, I said, uh, well, if you want to play the, uh, the, yeah, the Cody Rhodes Triple H angle and play you know, backstage <laughs> politics and get your I match you. to graduate, yeah. then. <laughs> hey, yeah, go for it. You know, oh, you yeah, know I'm not do. that good, so I gotta force myself down people's throats. Yeah. You know what I mean? You gotta <laughs> have that neck tattoo. But oh, Matt, man. I, I also said that if anybody gets a uh, rather sizable neck tattoo, they can graduate any match they want. <laughs> so that is on the table, just in case okay. someone does want to go that route. Do we know what? What does it have to be of? Can it be Autobot or Decepticon? It could be the, the it could be the Sorgatron Media logo. Yeah. Um, it can be Cody Rhodes logo. Matt. Right, you know, whatever. That's right here, the Mayhem Mania star. Yeah, you want to put that right up there? <laughs> Cody Rhodes take, is taking a hell of a chance. Hell of a chance. I mean, hey, if you want to graduate a match, these are the <laughs> lengths gotta, that you gotta be willing to. Gotta be willing to risk to it you. all. If these you are win the Mayhem Mania. these are the avenues that are available to you. Uh, it's like a you know one of those bad. It's like a monkey paw, you know. Oh, if you want to graduate a match, here's what you I mean, what to do. You're Chad. You're you're doing a great job, just like you have done in the past. Whenever uh, 
we've called upon you to come in and, and step in, and, and you're doing great. Uh, Mayhem Mania is in great hands, the best hands, probably the best hands it's ever been in. Uh, and I would tell you all that I'm going to sleep easy tonight, but that's not true because I'm not going to sleep at all because I'll be up watching wrestling from half a world away. Uh, Damn straight. Long, so. Tis the season. But, uh, kudos to all of you guys. Great job getting the train out of the station, and now we get to see what kind of meddling the kids can come up with next yes. week. Now the real fun starts. Exactly. The betrayals, the backstabbing, the name mm-hmm. calling. Hurt feelings. It's all going to be there. Justin. Tina's already talked some trash. Oh, so. yeah. Oh, no, no, oh, yeah. Tina's not going to get a right. match in in this year. Mm-hmm. Tina, yeah, no, Tina, um, Tina called this underwhelming for the first night. Oh, man. Shots fired. I think it's a solid start. We've had some years where we have come out of the gates, like limping out of the gates and just I gave what I said, a B minus, and then night two I gave a solid B. Yeah, I, Matt, I think uh, I think they're both solid Bs. You got to got to leave them some room to grow a little bit. I think. Matt, do you have yeah. a favorite match so far? Do I have a favorite match? Uh, I tell you what, that Dalton Castle Warhorse match really sticks with me. I'll tell you that for sure. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Um, and uh, you know, goddamn, uh, Muda versus wait, who who's Muda against? The Fiend. The Muda Fiend. versus the Fiend. Cinematic. Oh yeah. baby! Uh, oh, it should be that should be the step. It should be one. It should be like a Taker AJ style cinematic match. Yeah, it could definitely go cinematic. <laughs> oh man, oh man, Muda. Oh, man. We want to put the dragons and the wolves in a zoo match. <laughs> Maybe the lions <laughs> dead. Maybe we can put them in the lions. Oh, in the the lions. Lions. Get the whole alphabet. <laughs> get the whole soup in there. All the whole yeah, Noah's Ark match going. Yeah, the running from the American <laughs> animal. <laughs> two of each, two by hey, two. They we, went we to should, the ring. We should add the bucks. <laughs> That's oh. <kind> of work. <laughs> oh, well, no one goes plenty. to the zoo to see the bucks. Come on. We have and then out of nowhere, the fabulous free birds come out. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well done. Thank yeah, you, Matt, job, for, uh, for uh, handing the keys to me. You, I believe we are in good hands. I, I can't wait. I'm excited. I'm excited to uh to to craft this thing, to wield it. I'm like the William Regal of of uh, Mayhem Mania. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, so, so wait, now, wait, 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 wait. Time out. So, so Chad, Chad, if my match graduates, um I give you permission to make it War Games. I'll sa- I'll try to find some fenced in region about eight feet up so I can just come out and walk out on it and then just say, you know. War games, exactly. <laughs> so, man, the the football league, the fantasy football league. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Are are we doing something with that this year? That sounds like I a mean, great thing to talk to people after we wrap true. up talking. <laughs> I mean, man, Dad and I are doing yeah. something with that. I know no you two are doing it. it. <laughs> yeah, you two are good. Yeah, there's going to be a belt exchange. No more, no less. Yeah, the belt. Okay. We, we, don't, Mike, we don't cross-pollinate. Mad Mike, right. take us home. All right. And uh, and uh, that is, <clears throat> uh, that's going to be it for the inaugural edition of Talking Mayhem Mania. Can't go too high because got people sleeping in the other room. But, yes, uh, so uh, thank you for, for this motley crew. And uh, thank you, Matt Carlins, for hopping in and... and Proving you know how most of our minds work. It was my pleasure. All right, and uh, that's it. I forget how we wrap the show. So that's okay. it. That's it. I'll take it from you. Ready? Yeah. Stay May Hemi. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at Sorgatron.